Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages. My name is Doggo33, and welcome to Mass Effect Free Insanity. Now, it's a lovely day on the Presidium, so I figured we'd go and take a walk together. But we're also here on... Uh, in order to figure out some house cleaning matters, so to speak. Why are there pigeons? Why the fuck are there pigeons in the Citadel? Oh, I'm not gonna... I'm gonna question that, but not not a camera. Anywho, um, we have some house cleaning matters to uh, keep up with. Fortunately, or kind of un, not I wouldn't say unfortunately. We just or fortunately, for that matter, we have some stuff we need to do because in this video, uh, we're gonna be curing Vagenophage, as you might have figured from the title. Um, but before we do that, we have to do some very last minute things because. Um, the way this works, after this, the next time you go to a citadel, you start mission fire, uh, mission fires on the citadel. If you don't do certain things now, you won't be able to do that. So, you're thinking, what exactly are these things? And luckily for you, I have a list, thanks to Mass Effect Wiki, so we'll just go ahead and hop up. So, um, to prepare, you have to complete all of these side quests. Um, most of these side quests, you also have some uh, decisions of note. Um, partner benefit increase and civilian deportation order. You don't get these automatic. You have to listen to conversations. Partner benefit increases on uh, docking bay D26, I believe. Uh, or whatever the enormity one is. Did that guy just walk through me? I don't know. I, I, that's besides the point. I'm I'm rambling a bit. Uh, that's on the uh, floor where you board the enormity. And this is the two security guards talking on the uh, right in front of pur Purgatory with two turn security guards who are talking. You have to listen to an uh, exercise for dialogue. And for this one, it's the Turian and a sorry couple you have to listen to in order to get the access with Spectre Terminal. You also, it's your last chance to talk to Garrus, talk to Joker and Edie on the Presidium. To, we'll get to that in a second, because we haven't done that yet. To talk to Vega in Purgatory. To interact with Thane Creel. So this one is very important, actually. You really need to do this. Um, yeah. Also, any interaction with Kelly Chambers, which she isn't in this game, because I've actually never figured out how to invite her up to dinner Mass Effect 2, because I talked to her a fair bit, but it just doesn't hasn't worked out. Maybe I'm just missing something. Maybe if... Someone could help me out, and I'll, I can figure it out. Anyway, that's comment section below for that. But we don't have to worry about Kelly. But all of these, um, some of these are the scanning mini games, shit like that. Um, a lot of the stuff you actually pick up. Hand our diplomat was the uh, we dealt with that with uh, with Kasumi. Um, there's also the bending evidence. The act, like I said before, the actual mission you can still complete, but the evidence you have to turn in before this. So. That said, we have to... We're going to check out the conversing thing. I finished up more or less all of these. I still got... Is it... Which one is it? Yeah, some of these we're actually going to unlock. Like the automated turret, turret schematics we'll get to. Heating unit stabilizers. We haven't unlocked it, but we will be able to. Same. Soon. Same with the Book of Flenix. But... Um, so all the Aria missions, the Attic and Traverse mission, will be fine. But we still have to turn in bending evidence, which we'll do that in a second. Um, real quick, I'll hop down to Joker and Edie. See if I have anything to say. I have noticed many displays of public affection on the Citadel. The rate seems disproportionately high. Everybody could die tomorrow, Edie. Hooking up. I wonder if this is how the Krogan feel. I wonder. I have spoken with many Vatarian refugees here, Shepard. It may interest you to know that they are much more agreeable when the hegemony is no longer watching. Hmm. Interesting. Excuse me, Shepard. I am looking through files and videos of human behavior. I have 1.24 million windows open, but your request is important to me. Please hold. Alright. Joker? You're kind of mute, aren't you? Damn it. Uh, we'll check in on Liara real quick. Though, actually... Can we have a doctor? Yes, we can. Okay. Hello, Shepard. Hello. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. I guess that's it. 
I recognize this person. Yes, I do. Mind giving me a drink? Oh, I saw this cutscene hey, for the first time last time I, I played. You. So. Shepherd, right? Heard you're fighting the Reapers. Yep. Matriarch Athena. You were working on Ilium. How'd you end up here? Nah. With the Reapers making noise, I figured it was time to get somewhere safer. So I moved here. I don't think so. I've seen some video footage of you looking at Liara. She wanna do you want they wanna fuck or does she wanna fuck Liara? Yeah. Patriarch Benazio was, um, was her mother. And she doesn't know it, but I was her father. Okay, thanks for finishing up that dialogue. You mean you were her other mother, right? No, I didn't pop her out. Hell, she never even met me. Sorry, if you were human, you'd both be called the mother, regardless of which one gave birth. Well, I'm not human, am I? Anthropocentric bag of dicks. All right, I'm sorry. You, you're being a bit of a bitch, but I, I do apologize for that. Why don't you talk to her instead of creeping on her? That's a little... Liara would love to meet you. Why? She doesn't even know me from a hole in the ground. Benezia ran off before the kid was born. Besides, this isn't charity work. She's one of the biggest intel brokers in the galaxy. And she's got some shady connections. Sure, yeah. Like a boyfriend who used to work. Uh, for not a work boyfriend. To fight the Reapers. And not working and with you're Cerberus. Not with him now, I know. If you were, you wouldn't get within a light year of Liara. Is that a threat? I'm no commando, but I've had a thousand years to learn to fight dirty. Nobody messes with my girl. Anyway. You combine her work with Benezia, and... Well, the matriarchs might have ordered it. That's not gonna happen. No argument here. Hmm. I only took these crap jobs to keep the matriarchs happy that she's under control. Hmm. Just as long okay. as we're clear. Nobody messes with my girl. Whoa! <laughs> Maybe you're good enough for her after all. I bet she'd like to meet you. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Oh, come on, I, I had a... Huh. I'm taking that as a no on meeting her. Oh, I never really figured out... I only found out about this last time, and I didn't really do any of the interrupts. I just kind of let her talk. But... Huh. I don't get why they don't have um, a non-romance option for that. Because I'm not... No offense to Liara, Mancers. Liara is... And I used to fu fucking hate her. But she's grown on me. A lot. But... Not interested in romancing her, and I wish they... She's not my girl. I don't know. Let's... Let, let's um... I found your son's body in the slums on Benny. He sacrificed himself to save his squad. Give it to him. Talk I, to him, this guy. See, Talk to this guy. Fuck, I could speak. Their guilt made them avoid me. They should feel honored by his sacrifice. I... I know that I do. Thank you, my friend. No problem. I'm sorry for your loss. Alright, so we got that done. Um... We talked to, um, how do you say it, I Theta? I had just heard it, but I forgot how you fucking say it. Um, alright, so real quick, I'll stop by the Spectre Terminal, so I can show you guys exactly what's the deal with the uh, Edortation, it's, uh, this is after the Grissom Academy, so you can just uh, allow that and it'll give you a little extra war assets. Um, 
This and this also are the um, ones that you have to do before you leave for the Citadel. So yeah, um, that's really everything that we really need to do, we've done. In fact, I don't... I don't see anything. Um, there's probably the, um, there's a thermal pipe we can buy, but that doesn't have a timeline, and we can probably just buy that on a, on a, for requisitions terminal, if anything, so I'm not too worried about that. Um, actually, I think we'll go and buy it real quick, fuck it. It's down in the comments, I was just there, I'm wasting a bit, a lot of time, but, we'll do that, then we're gonna head up to the top floor real quick, cause we gotta... I'm gonna talk to a little friend real quick, give him a little pep talk. Welcome to Canala Exports. Thank you for shopping at Canala Exports. Welcome to Elcos Combat. There we go. Uh, that's the, um, this is what you want to buy for the mission, the E-Gel Thermal Conduit. Uh, these conduits can channel massive quantities of thermal energy, energy via thermal conductive gel. These typically are used in cooling systems of large-scale ESO drive cores. Sounds very, very useful. So, let's get moving. Welcome. And we gotta, we'll stop by the, um, docking bay real, docking bay real quick. Fucking voice cracking. Dang it, man. Now arriving at docking and, bay um, 24. we got a friend to talk to. Help him out, hopefully. Uh, this is a couple, by the way, that you need to listen to. Just so you know. Cortez finally made it off to Normandy. Glad I did. Even with the chaos of all the refugees, seeing so many ships in flight is comforting. Gets me thinking. Hey, a Turian frigate. I think that's the PFS Havenkov. What's one Turian warship doing at the Citadel? Looking for dry dock, I bet. She's seen battle. Look at the waiver in her drive core emissions. Alone, limping, looking for a haven. Maybe it would have been better to just go down fighting, like their families back home. I'm noting a... I'm sensing a metaphor here. Are you talking about the Turians or yourself? I should have been there. With Robert. I'm glad you weren't. You'd be dead, and we'd never have met. Yeah. Well, that's the one good thing from all this. I'm glad to serve with you, Shepard. Well, there's no point in dropping if it's still good for us to be doing, you know? The lives of future generations rest on those Turians' shoulders. On our shoulders. Nobody is giving up. Not those Turians. Not me. Not you. If anyone can pull this all together, it's you. Is that an Alliance cruiser? What's it doing here? That's the SSV London. Decommissioned years ago. Look. No guns. Refugees must have salvaged her from a shipyard. Geneva-class cruisers always had easel cores like granite. People find a way to survive. Mm. Do whatever it takes to see another day? Pretty much. <sighs> Gotta let go. For real this time. The refugees here put up a memorial wall. They leave mementos of lost loved ones. I was thinking maybe... Why not? What's stopping you? Nothing. I mean... Let me think about it. That's fair. Take your time, buddy. Your suggestion to come out here was a good one, Commander. I know. I needed this. I know. Anyhow. Alright, well. We've done enough. Oh, sorry. Um, we've done pretty much everything that we need to do. So just a reminder. Um, if you haven't talked to Thane, and if he's still alive, it's cr very important to talk to him. So... I talk to him as soon as you can. We'll get into that when we get to the next video and when that all whole thing happens. But you'll you'll understand in time. Actually, oh yeah, next video. I'm probably gonna have to stop recording because it's fucking midnight and I have school tomorrow. Um, any emails? Doesn't look like it. Commander. Uh, trainer. I'll make a little. Rotation around the ship real quick.
Joker. Commander. Maximum dynamic pressure is approaching. Throttle down for minimal resistance. Thanks, Mom. If that is how you categorize me, I will tell you to stop slouching. Hello, Shepard. Hello. Um... I don't think there's going to be that much inf important info, so... I guess we can walk around real quick, should we? Actually, real quick, I'm going to go back to, um, because I just realized how to, what I was missing in the hole. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I apologize. This is take care It'll be there momentarily. It's going to take a while, and I do apologize for that. Uh, we got to hustle, because I guess we have to talk to Liara. In order to get her to actually talk about Benezia. Talk to Benezia. And I think we get war assets out of that, so, um. Uh, hey. The bartender over Your there. Your dad is creeping on the you. The matriarch hired by the Asari government to track my movements? She's your father. I know. Yeah, of course you fucking know. What am I. I never get to surprise you with anything. I'm a very good information broker. Apparently. And you haven't talked to her about spying on you? If I did that, they might send someone who wasn't as sympathetic to me. Besides, this is hardly the time for family reunions. Why not? This is literally the moment for family reunions. Liara. Oh, fine. If you don't talk to her now, you may never fucking talk to her, you know? Oh, war asset updating. A sorry second fleet. See? Come on. You can't blame the matriarchs for keeping an eye on you. I am not my mother. Mm, you did threaten to flay someone alive with your mind. I had to make them take me seriously. I wasn't going to actually do it. And you bugged my office on Ilium. Ooh. That'd be the logical conclusion. Yeah. <laughs> Ouch. Um. So we got all that dialogue extended. Apparently we got the, um. Okay, fuck off, Ad. My bad. I'm sorry. That was just me looking at the wiki to make sure everything was good. Um, okay, yeah, now let's fucking go kill something. And we can just teleport right to the Normandy, which is very nice, so. Yeah, let's kill some shit, guys. Leave orbit. Mass relay. It's time to cure the genophage, ladies and gentlemen. So, last reminder, actually, um, also keep that page up, I just flash that if you guys want to do it, but look at it for, for another second, and you didn't get a chance to pause, go back and pause. There's something that's going to pop up, a little moral quandary that, you, that we might have to deal with. Now, I already know what I'm going to do, and if you know, you kind of know. If you play this game enough, you gotta know what's coming, but. We'll, we'll get to that in Joker, a second. What have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're gonna be able to land a shuttle there. Fuck. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, sir. New form of Reaper, Shepard. Using Shroud to poison Tuchanka's atmosphere. Hmm. Problematic. They want to fight! They just got one. Primark, we're gonna need your help. 
That could be difficult. Our losses on Palavin have been catastrophic. Listen, this is for Palavin, okay? If we don't do this, we don't... We can't... We're doing this for Save Palavin. Palavin. No one said it would be easy. I can't speak, but you know what I mean. What do you have in mind? A combined attack. Your people hit the Reaper with an airstrike. Rex, at the same time, your soldiers will be attacking from the ground. Together, you can draw it away from the tower. Yes, distraction. Small team can reach Shroud Facility, finish synthesizing Cure. We'll need Eve to come with us. Okay. Are you all ready? Because we need to be ready for this. We've never faced a Reaper up close like this. Everyone on board? There's even a doubt? Let's move, Pijak. It's time to cure the genophage. Commander, incoming message marked urgent. I'll put it in the comm room for you. Hmm. Interesting. Convenient that it, it comes in when everyone is gone, but... Dalatrus? Commander Shepard, we know you've reached Tuchanka. We've been and at Chunker for a I while, actually. Warden Solus has proposed using the Shroud. Are you spying on us? Yes. Hardly. The Shroud is the only viable course of action open to you. Commander, you can't allow your misguided sympathy for the Krogan to cloud your judgment. Do you honestly believe curing the Genophage will end in lasting peace? Yeah, I do. We have to give the Krogan that chance. You can't condemn an entire race to extinction based on what might happen. What will happen is the Krogan will reproduce out of control. We uplifted them specifically for their violent nature, not their diplomatic skills. Another war is inevitable. Well, if we keep treating them like we have been, maybe. Dress? Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you are planning couldn't be done. Morden will likely detect this malfunction and repair it. But if you ensure that he doesn't, then the cure's viability will be altered just enough so that it fails. No one will notice the change. You mean trick the Krogan? They need not be any the wiser. Let Erdnot Rex believe you fulfilled your promise. Morden would never stand for that. How you deal with him is up to you, Commander. We can provide you our very best scientists to build the Crucible, and the full support of our fleets. If I sabotage the cure. Think about it, Commander. The choice is yours. Okay, well. We have an interesting choice here. And now I'm going to explain to you why you should cure the genophage. Should I do it now or should I hold off on explaining it? Now first off, i got to pick a squad. I'll go... Who would I want to go with? I'll take James and I'll take Garrus. Well, it's mostly Reapers, but we all have a fair amount of armor-piercing stuff. We don't have too much... We don't have any barriers or really anything to deal with. Shields, we have Garrus to deal with. Armor, we have a very good squad with James and Garrus to beat. So, we'll do that. Okay, now that I've... <sighs> now, obviously, it's up to you morally, but... The way that everything is set up right now... I'm going to explain to you mathematically why curing the genophage is the best option. Okay, so... If you sabotage the cure, and Rex is the Krogan leader, eventually he's going to figure out. After... what is it? After the Rannoch story arc, when you go to the, the Citadel, once you try to be, get back on the, uh, the Normandy, Rex will be waiting for you. He'll reveal that he knows that you sabotage the cure. And one, you have to kill him. You have to kill him. There's no talking your way out of it. He will k kill you. Well, it's a cutscene, so he can't. He can't kill you, but you have to put him down. And not only that, but he takes away all of the Krogan war ass. Well, not all of them, but most of the war assets, which is about he provides 300. War I have the exact numbers right somewhere down here, actually. That's why I kept a wiki up. Um, the Salarian First Fleet is worth 150 points if you sabotage the Cure, while the combined score with Clan or not and with Rex is 330 points, along with another 75 for Mercenaries. I think that you might be able to keep the Mercenaries if Rex dies, but all this goes right down the toilet. And 75 plus one, 150, that's 225. You lose with 330, 
losing 330 for two, 225. 330 for 150, that's not worthwhile. Now, say if you're playing the game for the first time, or, or you didn't play Mass Effect 1, Rex dies automatically, or you just killed Rex off on Vermeer. If Reeves leader, you can actually, if you can, you can sabotage your cure, and you'll actually get 475 war assets, even 500 if you convince Morden to stand down, though Eve has to die. So, mathematically speaking, if you're playing, if you've been playing Paragon the whole way anyway, odds are you're gonna cure Vigenophage anyway. But if you're more renegade grade inclined or just want the more practical option, know that. If Rex is the leader, and you sabotage the cure, you're shooting yourself in the foot. Now, if you play multiplayer and get all the wars or assets like that, it doesn't really matter in the end. But, pragmatically, it's the best option. Also, there's a question of Eve. I, I, I mentioned a few videos ago that she can die. Um, as far as I recall, the only thing that decides whether she lives or dies is whether Malin's data has been saved or not. If it has, you're good, she'll live. If not, she's dead, she'll die. So, now that I've uh, done a little bit of exposition dump, instead of actually start, or start uh, the combat, let's start the combat. Um, like I said, this, isn't ju this is supposed to help you guys out. Not only with combat-wise, but just ge general tips. It's our sacred meeting ground. Okay. We'll land there and take an armored convoy against the Reaper. Sounds like a plan. This will be the defining moment of Krogan history. Krogan history filled with defining moments. Most bloody. Hope this one better. Fingers crossed. <sighs> Commander, you seem trouble. Uh, yeah. I got a message from the... Rex, it's Reap. Reapers are already at the hollows. Come out with guns blazing. Sorry. Hang on tight. We're heading in. Okay, shit. Okay, for the record, you can try to reveal it now or not reveal it. And if you need more time to think it over, you can reveal it later or just decide to let Morton cure it when he gets there. Shepard, keep them away from the female. I'll sort out what's happening with the other clan. All right, 10-4. Let's go, boys. Oh! Oh shit. That's not so good. Everyone right. pick your targets and keep an eye on our six. Now move! Okay. Oh, shit. I didn't even do that. Didn't need to do that either. Don't let him get up here. about this someday. Hell yeah. Reaper blood has finally soaked our soil. Oh, not finally, but... You know what, for story-wise, yeah, finally! Get to the shroud. The airstrike is on its way. Female safe, Shepard. Vitals are strong. What's a Solarian doing here? Oh, Nobody I read. said anything about this. Multiple Krogan. Problematic. Um, who the fuck are you? Who are you? Erd not Reed. Brood brother to our illustrious leader. <laughs> Reeve and I share the same mother and nothing else. For which I'm thankful. I remember what it means to be a true Krogan. <laughs> yeah, if Rex dies, we that's our leader. alive and drown them in a geyser of their own blood. We don't invite them into our home. Charming, I know. Um, if he's the leader, you can sabotage the cure, and he won't, he's a fucking idiot, so he won't realize it. So you can cheat the system and get all the assets by doing that, but you also have this jackass as leader. 
think you have a Krogan are probably gonna die out if you don't if you don't, so you know, kinda works out. Slarian's with uh, me anyway. Slarian's with me, asshole. Fuck Solarian off. Slarian is not your enemy. He's here to help cure the genophage. His kind gave us the genophage. Why should we trust him? Because <laughs> I do. And so will you. Oh dear. It's gonna be a fight, isn't it? Oh shit, here comes music. You can stay here and let old wounds fester as Krogan have always done. Or you can fight the enemy you were born to destroy and win a new future for our children. I choose to fight. Who will join me? I will. I will. And so will I. Now hold your hands high like true Krogan. There's a Reaper that needs killing! Ah. hoo -ah! Let's go! Woo! Fucking hyped. Alright. So, we gotta deal with a Reaper at the Shroud. Copy that, Artemek. We're on our way, trying to make up lost time. Shepard up. Reed isn't the only Krogan who wants revenge for the Genophage, Rex. You'll have to placate them somehow. I'll demand the Council return some of our old territory. We'll need room to expand. Recapture the glory of the ancients. Smart? What? Glory of ancients led to Krogan Smart. Rebellion. I can see Outless it. deaths. Creation of Genophage. Expansion plan problematic. <sighs> Tell me about the ancient Krogan. I'm curious. What were the ancient Krogan like? Tachanka wasn't always a wasteland. In the old times, the Krogan were a proud people. We had dreams, a future to look forward to. Until Salarian interference? No, we destroyed Tachunga ourselves. Technology changed us. It made life too easy. So we looked for new challenges and found them in each other. Nuclear war was inevitable. But now our planet is rubble. We'll need a better place to live. Well, I mean... I suppose after for um, all the effort you guys are going to be putting in... Planet or two. I think you guys deserve I think they deserve it, don't you guys? I'd say helping defeat the Reapers would be worth a new planet. Or ten. You haven't seen how fast we can pop them out. <laughs> Rex. What? With the Genophage cured, we'll have a lot of catching up to do. Commander, right. on the shuttle. Was there something you were going to say? Okay, so if you guys don't want to reveal the sabotage, either for roleplay reasons or Whatever else. Um, you can say nothing for now, and you still have the option. If you select this, you won't be able to sabotage the cure. So this kind of locks you in. Like I said, I, I've made my arguments clear why it's pragmatic. Pragmatically the right option. I also think it's morally the right option. At least if Rex is the leader for Reeve. Reeve, that's a different story. But, um, yeah. We're going to go ahead and reveal the sabotage, locking us out of, sa of the... Um, Sabotage option. tried to cut a secret deal with me. What kind of deal? She said they sabotaged the Shroud years ago. The cure won't work unless we fix it. Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you're planning couldn't be done. And she thought we wouldn't know better? Apparently. Correctly. Would likely have fooled tests. But familiar with STG work, can adjust. Did not come this far for nothing. You just spared our race another genocide, Commander. I told you we could count on him. Why are we stopping? Ah, oh, fuck. Shit. 
Rex, you and Morden stay with Eve. It's looking ugly out here. Oh, no. <sighs> okay. We just got a lot of Paragon score. Um. So, yeah, before we can even sabotage or cure the genophage, we have to make our way over there in the first place. And it looks like shit's comp uh, that that's complicated things. So, real quick, we have some arms, uh, some mods Sabotage we should pick up. We can't sit around like this. I mean, we can. We just probably shouldn't. What's up, soldier? This combustion manifold isn't going to last long. Let's get moving. All right, point taken. I was shouldn't. Hang on. Like it's the end of the world out there. A growl spike thrower. And remember to bring it back when you're done. Um. Supposed to fight a war I mean, they not good. Not good at all. I mean, people have managed before. I know. I know. I know. I know. What's up, sir? What's the holdup? Roads out. The convoy can't make it through. Shit. Turian Wing Artemek, this is Shepard. We've been delayed. Hold off your attack. Negative, Commander. Our approach is locked. The Reaper already knows we're here. Oh, fuck. Um. An airstrike alone won't do it. We have to get in that fight. Care if we have to build a new road, we're going. Oh shit! I've lost control. Fuck. I can't pull up. Move! Oh shit! Rex, get the female out of here now. Go! Well, do you copy? There goes the road. Fuck. Understood. Save your pilots. We'll find another way. Shepard, a tunnel over there. Maybe a way off. Okay, yeah, shit. Get to it! So, yeah, um... We gotta figure this out Rex, first. are you receiving this? Is everyone okay? Yeah, just scratches. Nothing this Valerian can't patch up. Reeves truck made it out, too. Oh, dear. The Turians had to call off the airstrike. We'll need a new plan for dealing with the Reaper. First we'll have to find what the you. Hell? Where did you end up? Tremor. Underground. We see ruins of some kind. Commander, that's the city of the ancients. How do we get out? No maps exist. It's been abandoned for thousands of years. Oh fuck. We're trailblazer, Shepard. Get through there and we'll find a place to meet up. Alright, sounds we'll good. Stop this cure. Damn straight. Um This all right? Well, I guess the Krogan could paint once upon a time. A nuclear war has a way of erasing the past. Hmm. Um, it looks like okay, there's no way out through here. So let's try over here. We're going lower. There it is again. That didn't feel like a tremor to me. Rex, are you guys feeling these tremors? Not up here. It could be something else, Commander. Okay, it's a drop. It said that Kalros, the mother of all Thresher Maws, lives in this region. The Which mother of all Thresher Maws? Get your ass out of there, Shepard. Step on it. So, do I really want to know who Kalros, the mother of all Thresher Maws, is? When the Krogan oh, name a Thresher Maw, you know you're in trouble. They don't think anyone's ever going to kill it. Um, I guess this is Kalros, mother of all Thresher Maws. Wild guess says that's Kalros. That's what's crawling around down here? Fuck. Okay. Well. Okay, 
Um, do I still have that crystal? I can maybe try to uh, dig my way out of here. Or we can, uh, we can go through here. Hope. Oh, hi there. What is that? Don't know, but at least it's dead. It can't be. Shepard, I think we've seen this before. You have? I'll be Rachni. damned. This looks like some kind of Rachni. You gotta be shitting me. But how? That queen you released on Novaria promised to live in peace. This one's different. Mutated. Or maybe giant insects are liars like everyone else. Rex, those rumors you heard were true. We've got Rachni here. I know. A few of them just attacked us. We'll deal with it later. Getting to that shroud is all that matters. Agreed. Mm. We're trying to find our way out. Hurry. You know, this is actually the first time I've done this mission without um, going to the uh, investigating the uh, Rachni like wheel. That. So that's the first time I've seen that. I don't know about you guys. But now this is new. Part of Chichanka that isn't rubble. Makes you wonder what the Krogan could have been if they hadn't nuked the place. Yeah. It's, it's kind of beautiful, actually. Rex, look at that sun. Outside. Well, if you can see sunlight, that's progress. And green. I didn't think plants grew here anymore. That is You're beautiful, at actually. All that's left of it on Tachanka. This is once a world full of beauty. Given a chance, it can be again. Shepard, that reaper is still up to no good at the shroud. Find a way out of there, and we'll pick you up. We're on. Look at that love sun. We're going to deal with the reaper when we get there. Look at that sun. I've I've never noticed the sun before. That is that is beautiful. I'm gonna. I I I, yeah, I forgot that's a thing, but. Let's take a little peeksy round. I know we got some combat and stuff. We can deal with up. Uh, that's the edge of war. Let's not. Let's ignore. We can ignore that. Let's get a. Okay, let's not go too high. Or else the uh, illusion's kind of killed. Yeah, let's go more more down. Way more down. Um. Way more down. This is more down. <laughs> Yeah, this is nice. Um. Yeah. Okay, that's, that's. Oh god, I got the. There we go. Let's get moving. The trucks are that way. Ahead, we've got movement. And of course, it's gonna be that easy. Just back in the frying pan, we'll touch Okay, so... Deal of Ravagers. Their little weak... So their little bags are their weak points, but the problem is... Um... They also deploy, uh, deploy those little spider things. And if they go up to you, they'll just fuck up your shields. So you gotta be careful, because their weak spot, or like their obvious weak spot, uh, it's not as simple as just uh, shooting it and not worrying about them anymore. Get okay, drag them. Yeah, and they um, they do a hell of a lot of damage. So you're gonna want to be careful. Indeed. Okay. Um. It's not over yet. It isn't. Fuck. Okay. There you go. Take cover. Any 
Ah ouais Ok, yeah. There we go. Ah, uh, okay. ideas on that. What? Not now, Rex. The commander has enough to worry about. What's happening? Some crazy idea we can talk about later. Just worry about getting out of there right now. Yeah, all right. A party. Okay, frag him. Shepard, looks like we got a bridge up ahead. Try to find it, and we'll pick you up there. All right. We're Sounds good. Right now. I didn't say it would be easy. Yeah, well, what fucking is in this world, you know? Okay, um, I'll read the sky. Ouch. 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 I hate these guys. And then you can do a compressive shot. Actually helps with um power you got. Shit, okay. There we go. Now we just gotta look, deal with little bastards. Yeah. I don't know, the rap the little guys are more annoying than any the swarmers are a little more annoying than anything, but if there's a lot of them, they can fuck up your shields. And it'll leave you vulnerable for someone else to take you out. Shepard, we're coming under the bridge. Get down here or we can get to the shroud. I will do. That doesn't whatever that wasn't. Oh. Rex! Yep! She's not gonna get us. Okay, well, of course it can be that easy. Just gonna over that. Fuck, that's not good. I'm kind of glad we're not in the truck. And the thing is, I bet Rex is enjoying this. Heads up, they're back. I'm on it. I'm on it too, fuck. Really get out of cover that well, so it's not. Uh, so far. Uh, charge, charge. Okay. Looks like a way down. Is there anything else I'm missing? Probably not. Okay, let's get the fuck off. Fuck away from here. Shepard, get over here. Breathe. Keep an eye out for that mole. I don't want it sneaking up on us. Make it quick, Rex. We're exposed. Move it. Move, Shepard. We're in. Go. Oh, what about Bye, Reeve? No way he survived that. But he was a pain in the ass anyway. Now let's finish this. There's a Reaper waiting for us. You weren't joking. There's a Reaper waiting for us. Okay. 
Um. I hope somebody has a plan B. I know we've beaten the odds before, but getting to that tower, I don't. <sighs> well. We're curing the genophage no matter what it takes. Everything my people will ever be depends on it. Then I hope this idea you were talking about is a good one. It was hers, actually. Calros. Okay. We summon her to the Reaper. Would that even Ooh, work? That's... Already discussed strategy. Just need to distract Reaper. Draw it from tower while cure synthesized. Released. Um... Tell me more about Calros. What makes you so sure she'll come? Legends say she is the mother from which all other Thresher Maws spawn. This is as much her home as ours. If Tuchanka has a temper, Kalros is it. Nobody's ever faced her and survived. <sighs> I mean, it's risky. Yeah, we have done crazier things. We flew through the Omega-4 relay and survived. We can do this. That's a spirit, Shepard. Hell yeah. How would we summon her? The tower was built in an arena devoted to Kalros's glory. The Salarians thought she would scare away intruders. Appears to have worked. There are two Maw Hammers there, the largest in existence. If you can activate them, Kalros will come. That should distract the Reaper. Meanwhile, right. laboratory nearby. We'll finish synthesizing cure. Okay. <sighs> Alright, be safe, everyone. Let's make sure we all get out of here alive. We're gonna have one hell of a story to tell. Wait! I want you to know that no matter what happens, you've been a champion to the Krogan people, a friend of Clan Erdnot, and a brother to me. To every Krogan born after this day, the name Shepard will mean hero! No. Now, let's show them why! Oh yeah! Let's go! Oh fuck. Yeah, yeah, let's go. talk about I've going. I am Earthnut Rex, and this is my planet! Oh. See you on the other side. Stay alive, Shepard. We'll have cure ready. Well... Let's uh, go I mean, to quite do that, but... Well, actually, it's so hard working, shit. So far, at least. Fuck, wrong button. We're kind of busy, Rex. Gotta climb up. Oh, hey! I know this gun, I have it already. Nine. Am I gonna get upgrade ten? Oh, baby, phalanx at level ten. They're all over us out here. Holy shit! Off to the left. Uh, yeah. All right, gotta be fucking. Okay. That... Okay. That complicates things. Everyone all right? I just got shot by a reaper. Consider that practice. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, Shepard. I raised the hammers. You have to activate both of them. My advice is avoid the giant laser. Who oh, you don't say? You've got to be dead. Just keep moving. Take the cover. I'm not sure how it's going to work. Do you have a better idea then? Artemis. Now that's some goddamn Go! 
Okay. On our left! One of the hammers! Okay. This is crazy. Yeah, but we've done great. <laughs> Let's be real. Oh. Mm. Okay, hammer one, hammer one, hammer one. Lord, we hit the first hammer. How's it coming? Fuck, fuck. <gasps> okay, uh... you it's an insta down so you gotta be careful with that second mom take care of the cure Love this mission. Whew. All right, so recording. Sorry. I think I just woke my sister up. My bad. <laughs> Mort, is the cure ready? Yes. Loaded for dispersal in two minutes. Procedure traumatic for Eve, but not lethal. Malin's research invaluable. She's okay? Headed to safety now. Her survival fortune will stabilize new government should Rex get any ideas. Good match. Promising future for Grogan. Damn! Control room at top of Shroud Tower. Must take elevator up. Wait, what? You're going up there? Yes. Manual access required. Have to counteract STG sabotage. Ensure cure dispersed properly. Morton, this whole thing is coming apart. There's got to be another way. Remote bypass impossible. STG countermeasures in place. No time to adjust cure for temperature variants. <sighs> no, no other option. Not coming back. Suggest you get clear. Explosion likely to be problematic. No, no. More, no. Don't. Shepard, please. Need to do this. My project, my work, my cure. My responsibility. Would have liked to run tests on the seashells. Goodbye, Mortem. I'm sorry. I'm not. Had to be me. Someone, Someone else, else might have gotten, gotten it wrong.
long time ago, my father betrayed me in this place. His own son. He tried to kill me, so I had to kill him. Right over there. That's what the Genophage reduced us to. Animals. But you changed that today, Shepard. Now we'll fight for our children, not against them. It's just a pity Morden had to die. Yeah. Yeah. Um... That's why I played through this game, like... Fucking 20 times now. That scene still gets to me. Like I say, he was a good friend. So, someone had it, it had to be him? Wouldn't have had it any other way. And I'm sure wherever he is, he's putting in a good word for us. We'll name one of the kids after him. Maybe a girl. <laughs> but you, Commander, we can thank you in person. Tell the Turians I'll be deploying troops to Palavan immediately. And when you're ready to kick the Reapers off Earth, you let me know. The Krogan are back in business. Goodbye, Commander. What will you do now? Spread the hope you've given us. Even now, there are clans gathering in the Kelphic Valley. I'll go speak to them and make sure this gift isn't squandered. Thank you for all that you've done. And know that Erdnot Bakara calls you a friend. It's good thing we don't have a bomb. Hell of a thing you just pulled off, Commander. Curing the Genophage? I never thought I'd see the day. Rex has agreed to help the Turians, Admiral. We should get their full support. I take it that leaves the Solarians out of the equation. The cost of yeah. their support was too high, sir. Well, I'll defer to your judgment on that, Commander. Let's hope we don't need them. Pack it. Out. Commander, Erdnot Rex has begun sending troops to Palavan. You kept your end of the bargain, and now I'll keep mine. The Turian hierarchy will stand with humanity against the Reapers. Ah, thank you. Thank you, Primarch. I'm glad we can help each other out. It's the only way we're going to defeat the Reapers. That much is certain. To that end, several dry dock ships are ready to help build the Crucible. Garrus will coordinate them. Yes, sir. And when the time comes to deploy it, the full measure of our fleet will be there for Earth. May the spirits watch over us all. I'll start managing Turian support right away, Shepard. You must be exhausted. Morden dying... It can't be easy. I'll sleep when I'm dead. We both know you need a clear head to win a war. There's no room for mistakes here. It's fine you should catch some mention sleep, because I'm... I'll make tired. sure Joko doesn't launch any suicide missions. <laughs> Come on, it's me you have to worry about with the suicide missions, but... Anything happens, you let me know. Oh dear, where, where are we? Buddies, it's okay. That won't happen. Go get him, Commander. I'll see you all when you get back. There you are. Shepard. Now go back and get the lieutenant 
and get the hell out of here. You know it's the right choice, LT. <laughs> I'm gonna sleep on my couch or the chair. It's open. Oh, hey, Liara. There's something you need to hear. All right. <sighs> what is it? Is this a bad time? <sighs> it's a good. It's as good a time as any, I guess. It's just. Thinking of some friends who aren't around thanks to this war. That's thanks to the Reapers, not you. Are you thinking about anyone in particular? Um. Good old Ash. Ashley, back on Vermeer. She gave her life stopping Sovereign. I wonder what she'd make of fighting a whole fleet of Reapers. If I had to guess, Ashley would call it target practice. Yeah. Sounds like her. Didn't you have something for me? The Solarian Counselor has an urgent matter. Let me guess. He called the comm room? The Council must be taking the Crucible seriously. Mm. I'll see you downstairs. Okay. This video must be going on for a while. Especially with all the little shenanigans Commander. at the start. There is something we should discuss if you are finished rewriting history. I made my decision, Counselor. There's not much anyone can do about it now. Yes. We're going to have billions more Krogan in the galaxy. It's a good thing you saved my life once, Shepard. Otherwise, well, I have concerns about humanity's representative, Counselor Udina. Yeah, he's a prick. We all know that. My agents have discovered that he's using his authority to move vast sums of money. For what purpose? We're not sure. <sighs> That's, yeah. It's worth looking into. If Adina's dirty, it's best we get to the bottom of it fast. Agreed. Come to the Citadel. We will review the evidence and discuss this in private. Valor out. All right. Um. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCon. <sighs> okay, we'll talk to Hackett real quick. And then we should really cut it here because it's probably, it's probably going for Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? How ready are we? What's our state of readiness, Admiral? The good news is we're managing to win in some sectors. The bad news is we're losing in others. I'm encouraged by our order of battle, though. It seems to be working. We just need to stick to it and pick up the pace. All right. How are, our, how are our allies doing? What about the extra help we picked up along the way? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Erdnot Rex running the show is a bonus for us. And that female Krogan you rescued is rallying more support from the other clans. I'm glad you disabled that mom and Tachunka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support. As it is, we picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. All right, what about, uh, Solarians? How about the Solarians? Interesting wrinkle. We've been getting back channel commitments from the strike teams within STG. They're promising to back us. Really? Even after I cured the genophage? Our intel suggests there are cracks developing between the military and the politicians. These STG guys know the score. They're not going to jeopardize the entire Solarium Union just because some Delatras didn't get her way. That's good. How are the Reapers doing? Do you know how the other races are doing against the Reapers? Believe it or not, the Turians and Krogan actually seem to be getting along. Erdnot Rex has deployed troops, and they're giving the Reapers a moment of pause. The Solarians are still hanging on to Sirkesh, but the Reapers are starting to breathe down their necks, too. Hmm. What about the Asari? They have to be feeling the heat. 
The Reapers are moving fast with the obvious intent of taking Thessia. Interestingly, the Reapers are leaving Parnak alone. It's the Yogg homeworld. Can't say well, that I blame them. Yogg have teeth. Yeah. Well, if we Fucking lose Yogg. this war, it might be them running the next cycle. It's easy to forget the Reapers don't destroy every species. Well, that's a terrifying Just the ones thought. who threaten them. Um about the Batarians. What happened to the Batarians? Those dirty bastards. They never stood a chance, hit by the Reapers straight out of the gate. And without any allies to call on, I think the Batarians are history. Quarant and Geth? I mean, we kind of got our our good friend and girlfriend out there, so we gotta, I wanna, you think we can count on her people? Or the sworn enemies? Have we heard anything maybe? from the Quarians or Geth? Something might be brewing near the Geth water, but our intel is sketchy. News is getting harder to come by as things get worse. Yeah, shit. Um, Hanar and Drell, how about... Well, we helped out Hanar and Drell, actually. Do you know anything actually. about the Hanar and Drell? Their luck is holding. For now, the Reapers have avoided a direct invasion of that sector. Though we've heard Drell wet war teams are mobilizing fast to shore up their border with the Solarians. Mm. I knew a Drell. The Reapers don't want to tangle with them. Good old Thane. Up Volus and Elcor. Any word on the Volus and Elcor? The Turians and the Krogan sent forces to the Volus homeworld, Irun. It might not be enough, but at least they've got Reaper forces bogged down in a nasty ground war. As for Elcor, they're still in the fight, though our projections show the Reapers encroaching on their territory soon. All right. Well, <sighs> thanks for thanks for talk, sir. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Understood. Okay, um, so Rex is gone now. Oh, we already got Master and Commander for achievement. That's nice. And Evictus is gone. So real quick, let's look over the war assets. We already have, right now, granted it's because of my readiness reading, but we have, if we went to the main battle right now, we have enough to get the best destroy ending, like all the best op endings, actually. So, yeah. Got Shadow Broker, Wet Squad. Um, got Reliance, Third Fleet. That's from Nairobi. Uh, I assume this is from uh, scanning stuff. Yeah, it's just uh, added stuff. So the Krogan, we get a very nice chunk from it. So, uh, Erdnut Rex, 30. Uh, the Krogan clans, nice boost here. Clan Erdnut and Krogan mercenaries. Now, just so you guys have some context, if we sabotage the cure and we had Rex, we'd lose all of Clan Erdnut. We'd also lose Rex as support. If we didn't defuse a bomb, we would lose another 300. And uh, this 300 too. So the Krogan support can go very down very quickly. So we... <sighs> Hopefully um, you guys have taken some of my advice when it comes to this. If not, okay, but... I mean, I like to roleplay as much as the next guy, but that might come back to bite you in the ass unless you really know what, we, what you're doing. And for Turians, we've got the 43rd Marine Division. 7th Fleet. And the Turian Engineering Corps. So, that's a very nice boost to our war assets. And, um, for the war map... Um, each... Each conflict zone has a radius reading that reflects its ability to contribute to final battle. Left unintended, these stones can deteriorate and reduce the overall radius readings. So this is the whole multiplayer map thing. So if you play multiplayer and finish the matches, uh, the score goes up and up. So yeah, um, I'm I still play multiplayer here and there. I um, I'm coming back from vacation from China, so I wasn't able to play much. So my Readiness went down a fair bit, but um, I boosted it up a little bit. It was at 60, now it's back at 80, 45-ish. 80, so, yeah. And um, this video is going on for way too long already, so we're going to have to cut it here. Or We don't have to, but we really should. Plus, I'm fucking tired. I want to get some sleep, and it's 1 a.m., and I have a class tomorrow at 9 a.m., so if I'm lucky, I can get my get enough sleep to make it through the day. 
Ah, fucking college, I swear. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you liked this video, go ahead and leave a like. If not, feel free to dislike. If you guys want to see more of my content in the future, go ahead and hit the subscribe button for more uploads every weekday, as well as every Saturday. If any comments, feedback, concerns, anything of the sort, go ahead and leave the comment section below. I read all the comments I get, and I appreciate any and all feedback you guys might have for me. If you want to support me financially, i got a Patreon down below. You can send a few bucks my way if you are so inclined. If not, I do understand, but this is the only way I can make money off this YouTube stuff, so I'd appreciate it if you at least uh, leave it, uh, consider it. Um, also, I have a Discord down link below if you want to join up with that. We can chat, play games, just have a fun old time generally. So, yeah, that's about it, guys. Thank you guys so much again for watching. My name has been Doug with 333, and I'll see you guys in the next video when we go ahead and uh, look for that dirty bastard, Udina. Yeah. Goodbye.